Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lennon. Hi guys, and uh, welcome back to our uh, 1177 AD Jerusalem campaign. Now, I do have to have a little bit of a story time with you before we get into it, because as you can see, this is not where we left things off last time. But like, I got some comments, I got some advice on how to get some more money, get the, get the ball rolling. Uh, but I recorded for like an hour and I got run into the dust and I was like, yeah, that is not going to happen. So with all the advice that I gained from you guys, uh, from the comments and everything, I, I was thinking like, let's still start a 2.0 uh, series. Let's see if we can do better this time. So with that being said, I am going to try my hardest um, to be an absolute boss, raid boss uh, this time over. Um, and just absolutely annihilate everything. So the most things you guys said was like um, join wars with other people so you can um, uh, so you can afford more stuff. And I also need trade agreements so I can get more uh, stuff going. So I could say like I could join your war. Um, against the Holy Roman Empire, which I cannot accept, basically. Okay, so uh, you guys were saying, like, that is the way you can get some more money going. So let's see if we can work that out. Um, I do need to hire these guys. And I do need to attack this. And I do need to fight this again. Um, we... Like, we won this last time, so I'm gonna fight it again, see if we can maybe even win it better. Because I also play as the Ayub Sult Sultanate, and this is a very tough army to beat. Like, I lost the battle on the other playthrough, but I did lose it that good that I won the second round. <laughs> Scaven Tactics <laughs> in Rome 2. Um, but I hope, like I said, I hope you guys do enjoy the this series. So let's leave a like and a comment for the 2.0 version. See if we can do better this time. Rain in the desert. Um, I would like to have a dry climate just to make this a little bit easier. And uh, this is not good. They have they have the downhill charge. I don't like that. Um, it's my main infantry core. Let's let's put you guys like uh, this. I don't want to face off. Um, just I don't want to face off like straight away there. Um, you can get in a shield wall. That is good. And then. You can get into a shield wall, that's good. Uh, your spears, that's not good. Um, so let's get these guys over here. Let's get these guys in between. So we have a little bit more a diverse core. And then spears on this side. And let's get more spears on this side. And then, so that is you and you are group two as well. Uh, stupid dog. I hope you guys don't f have too much issues with the dog. What do you do? You provide loyalty and pride. Okay, so let's get you somewhere around here. That you can do that and then just drop the ball and... And where's the rest of my calf? Okay, I think this is how we want to try this out. Um, I do think I want to see if we can get towards the corner. And probably then we have to attack them because we are the attacking side. But if they do feel like they have the upper hand, they might go for it. Mortis. 
Uh, I think they'll go for me. Go, they'll go for it. What did you pop? Quick reload. Okay, that's good because that gives you fatigue. And you're probably missing most of your shots anyway. The men are wavering. Okay, well <laughs> that didn't go as planned. Did you get any kills? No, okay. <laughs> um, so we it looks like we have to move forward. So they won't they won't move. Oh this is an opportunity. Uh Saracen Calf got my general there as well. Heavy calf contingency? Those armored archers are fucking dying today. I might have lost one unit, but they are about to lose two units. Why are you guys so fucking slow? need you guys to target that one and I need you to target that one. So he is not moving back. You guys are idiots. I like it when a game does stupid shit like that. Charge bonus, melee attack. Uh, I should be able to kill this. Very heavy melee calf, medium melee calf. We should be slaughtering those guys. And we should be slaughtering those guys as well. Are we losing it? Oh, I lost one unit here. They are losing 8, 10, 12, 12 to 2. Okay. You get after that one. You get after that one as well. Chase him, chase him. Don't let them come back. Don't let them come back. So I lost two horsemen. Um, they lost an entire unit of horsemen and a unit of um, archers, which is okay. So that is a calf unit that is gone, that's good. These guys I want to get away from. Do they have more naftas? Okay, no, okay. We focus uh, that flank. I want to be nowhere near those NAFTA throwers. And those are Arabian Axis. I want to see if I can draw out more of these calf units. Just move forward. Javelins. Okay, shit is starting to pop. Let's go back. Okay, we are killing that one easily. 
That's why Spears will be able to kill that. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, this flank is holding. That is your mistake. Oh, why are this guy still holding? Shit. That's not good. Uh, those javelins are gone. Let's start targeting those Persian bowmen. Why are these guys... They're r really fucking slow. That really sucks. Um, yeah, you're doing fine over there. I could use a little bit more infantry on this flank. Okay, they're already tired. That is a problem. Since when is everything moving this slow? I feel like I feel like we already moved like we moved a lot faster. Okay, now we target the javelins. Oh, those are noble swordsmen. Yeah, that's the problem. Um, the javelins. Okay, this is going really fucking slow. Out of there, target the Arabian nobles. Our men flee the field of battle. Ghazi. Like these fuckers are just like these javelin men are faster than my calf units right now. Uh, target the Persian bows first. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shame. Oh, that was a fucking... The Naftas are killing us. Like, look at this! So fucking Naftas are killing everything. Okay, this is good. I'm rolling up on this flank. Uh, yeah, you need to get out of there. Okay, this is a lot harder than it was last time. I don't know why. Uh, you target the, start targeting the general. You get out of there, start targeting this flank. Uh, okay, we finally caught the javelins. That's good. It's about even. Oh, target the naftas, that's probably the better idea. Um, Spears get back, you get back. Where are the Nafthas now? Uh, 
Uh, drop your equipment and just engage in melee. Those guys. Maybe Naftas are dying out. That's good. Um, calf. Oh shit. That's not good. 74. I don't like this idea. My general needs to get out of there. And take that. Your honors, our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful. Uh you are javelins out of ammo, okay. Uh take a rear charge over there. Take a rear charge over there. Um okay, my general is routing, but these guys are nearly on the route. Okay. Calf is out. Calf is out. Okay, that's not good. Okay, their general is gone as well. That's good. That is good. Um, I still do need to kill them. Um, I need to get around to that. Oh nope, nope. Attack the noble swords. I need to get out of way. Out of. I need to get out of there. Um. Uh, Target this. Missile left tree, get back. Uh, I need to get those noble swords. Go that way. Our men flee the field of battle. Uh, you guys target those, target that. Um, target that. Uh, okay, nice. Target these guys. Who sells ammo? Okay, uh, start targeting Persian horse archers. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a fucking tough fight, man. The battle is turning in our favor. Nice. Whew. Okay, this is a good start. <laughs> this is a good start. A good start for a first episode. For first uh, 2.0 episode. I think I did this worse than last time. I feel like my units were so much slower than last time. I don't know if there was an update to that, but... I don't know if, even if it was, but my units felt so much slower. Like, my calf, like, really felt as like it was just walking. The javelin men could outrun my calf units, which I find pretty... Pretty, pretty, pretty impressive, actually. <laughs> um, 2700, yeah, I do need that, because that is basically another... Um, that's another, like, turn of stuff. And you... 200, 117, um, 122, 74, light bowman, okay, that is four bowmen, that's enough, and then, 
I would like to get a few of these, maybe one of them, and then the rest just needs to be this. Because I have like two turns worth of stuff. So, triple E, you. You want a military alliance? Okay, so that is another 2k I can shit. It's another. Our ancestors have spoken. And they have named you. Join war against for. Okay. For my That's another 2k. Then we'll still want a military alliance. We'll st ask a thousand. Sure. You speak wisely. Um. Okay. That gives me another extra turn of recruitment. And it also helps me with Triple E. And I'm not starting to starting with attrition. That is fine. That is good. I feel like that's better. Like I believe like last time I started with taking attrition as well. Um I cannot recruit anything here. I think this is all we can do for this turn. So we need 20 settlements, this one, Lower Egypt and Syria. Oh, only hold 20 settlements. <laughs> like I didn't just get wiped out last time. Oh, it's only 20 settlements, no worries, no worries. We can do that easily. <coughs> got wiped out after two settlements. Oh, no. Honestly, I don't want to, because I want money for that, but... I can still catch you, right? Yeah. This should be an easy auto. And then that's another 100. And that saves me like 600 in upkeep. Yeah, I just need the infantry. And we don't have armor stored anymore. Okay. Can't get another one of these guys. Um, medium melee infantry, heavy melee infantry, medium melee infantry. And with this army, I'm straight going for Al Karak. And then this army can join in. I don't think I should go for Alexandria. I think I should push this way. Uh, Jerusalem can defend itself. That's not a problem. The issue is money. Like, I'm going to be out of money like in a turn. Yeah, that saves me a lot on recruitment. Those guys are really fucking expensive. Uh, so that's one turn on... Do you want peace by any chance? Yeah, you definitely don't want peace. I don't I know that. We have need of talk, I'm sure. And also wine. They are not at war with anyone. Papal states, you are not at war with anyone. Okay. There's not much I can do, to be honest. Do I need Rome as an ally? No. That makes them probably not like me very much. <laughs> Speak your speech so that I may go to the baths and wash away today's stench. 
See, I cannot, I cannot ask them to any do anything just yet. So, Antioch, can I join your wars? No. Like, I don't share borders with them, so I can't really do anything. Do that. Money gained four hundred. It's not even worth to loot or raise settlements. I don't have any I don't even have enough money to get through this turn uh, what if I merge you guys that should be f better um, these guys are just hella expensive can I by any chance replace this general for a cheaper unit oh well that didn't work out. <laughs> That's 700? Well, fuck that shit. I don't know, 195, Like, I have a decent army here. That's something I need to hold on to. Um, so we raid the shit out of him. Uh, am I willing to drop some of these crossbows? Like, that's another five, six hundred. I know it's our good unit, our best units, but that makes means we can maybe even build. Uh, something here next turn uh, which would be preferable probably should have fought it myself to minimize casualties I think that was the better way to do it Uh, okay, can we replace you again with the king then? No, fuck. <laughs> Oh, I can go straight over here. Shit. Uh, am I losing... Okay. That is only losing me a slight bit of money. There's not much I can build here. Uh, you, I do share a border with you. Will you let me join your war against the Umayyad Empire for like 2k? On behalf of my people, I accept. The haggling is done, and we have an end to our talk. Okay, so. Generous nature does your people credit. But really, such a uh, thing is not okay, necessary. that is not helping. Uh, that is helping me build something here that might help. Um, 100 wealth from manufacturing. 50 wealth from commerce. hundred a thousand I think I'm gonna go for this it gives me food and influence 
Um, nom 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 nom. Catholicism, Catholic is going up. That's good. Uh, I feel like we're in a very, in a little bit of a better position than last time. So. Um, like this help with 2% land units. Melee defense. Battering ram. 1% wealth from agriculture. That is, see, like, now that is interesting. Because with that, well, it would only be like a 4 extra, like 1% is like not even 1 <laughs> extra wealth from agriculture, but. Everything helps. Uh, so yeah. Probably should fight this, but I don't want to. I just get more money for this. I think I will build them over here. No, I really I really can't afford that. I can if I lose some of these units. Yeah, this is a hard call. Do I weaken my army to push on? I think I probably should. So these guys are still taking attrition like no but like it's nobody's business. I'm recovering. So I don't need to worry about that. I need to worry about Al Karak. Well, I really don't need to worry about it because these guys are friends. So I just need to push. So I think that is where we leave it for today. So I hope you guys are enjoying this 2.0 series. This one I will do continue. So I'll probably record one part straight after this. So ladies and gentlemen, I just want to say thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment with more tips and suggestions because I really need them. And do by all means subscribe to the channel. It's really appreciated. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.